Okay, today I'm showing how to clean with uh, HVAC 444 some shower doors. Um, I don't work for HVAC 44 or anything, I just think it's such a great product. I do make a little commission if you order it off my website, so if you are going to buy it, order it there. It helps me out a little bit. Okay, well here it is, nice and tub door guide. All glued in place and all settled. Silicone, all dried there and everything working like it should, everything lines up. You can check out my video on adjusting the pivot of the door handle. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Had to get that out there. Uh, what I have to show you today is cleaning these up. And what I have is this HVAC 444, which is just is some awesome stuff for this. Um, it works really good to clean, especially the anodized metal um, but it also leaves a protective coating that keeps the water running off and I'll just spray it on and show you as it just starts to work especially on those gnarly calcium deposits and it doesn't even really take much um, wiping I just kind of spray it on and let it do, do its thing um, but it also works good even on the, the face on the glass because again it, it'll leave a nice coating on there that um, keeps the water running off so I'll just I'll be cleaning the inside as well as the outside with it and um, there we go step inside here and you can see all that calcium build up right there so we'll just hit that and again, I'll just kind of get the whole door and wipe it on. And it'll create that protective coating as well as clean off the deposits. Okay. And then I'll just grab my rag and wipe it in. That starts to work in. I'm not really going to wipe it off the metal yet. I'm just going to focus more on the glass for now. On the metal part, I kind of want to let it eat at all that calcium deposits that's in there. Bring the inside here. Again, this will just leave that nice coating on there and you can see how it's really cleaning up those calcium deposits and giving us a nice bright finish. Of course there's limits to anything. <laughs> this has some previous scratches from maybe the previous door that was in there. Anyway, you can see our door is now nice and shiny and we've got that protective film on there that's going to keep the water running off really good. And now I'll wipe down the metal on the bottom as I was telling you. You can see how it's just taken all those calcium deposits and just obliterated them. All right, a little more spray here. Polish that metal right up. And 
Anyway, there we go. Nice new shower doors. All set there. Um, one little tricky part is a little bit right in between the gloss and usually what I can do is just kind of get in there with my rag, spray a little bit on my rag and kind of put it in between. Just like so and kind of use the pressure of the other shower door to just kind of swipe it on in. Get it done. Spray a little more on it. Get this lower part down here. The last little tricky spot down there in the corner, huh? We got it there. Good to go. Nice new shower doors. How set? Last one, maybe this little um, the back of the second door. It might have been good to clean this while it was off, but you can definitely see a little bit of deposits there. I'll just use my pliers, push that down. Good to go. Nice new shower doors. It just makes a big difference.